Hello YouTube programmers, welcome back in my tutorial. I hope you are doing great. So today we are going to make that how we can shatter a big object into small fragments in Unity. So let's start to make our today's video. So first take a look what we are going to make. Okay, so let's start to make our today's video. For shattered or breaking objects, we need a breakable object. So you can, you can download this from the asset store of Unity. Here you can see, just click over the asset store of Unity and right here the breakable. Here you can see, you will get these breakable assets. Click any one of them and download and import it into the, your assets just go back to the scene here after you get your assets here you can see i have this pottery assets you can see in the scene view i have the bowl and a cube just drag and drop your object into the scene for adding your object into the scene here here you can see I have a plate and here you can see when I click on the bowl and just drag and drop into the scene here you can see I have a bowl so now first we need to create we need to add a breakable bowl so in the assets which you have downloaded yet in that you will get options click on this one here you can see the plate broken so first we need to add this plate broken into the scene so just drag and drop into the scene here so first add the plate broken into the scene click on it here just select these four options by press control and select these four and go to the add component click over here and the rigid body as well as we need to add the mesh collider here you can see check this convex here you can see the breakable part of this plate and change its rigid body mass to 22. Now click on it and just drag and drop into the, your scene this plate broken here. So just drag and drop into your assets click on this original prefab now here you can see you added this plate broken into the your asset now just click on it or uncheck this object presents into the scene now you need to again add the plate into the your scene this one just drag and drop into the your scene here at the place where your the plate broken take the for know the place and the position in the scene here and tick again this and choose this plate and just go to the inspector here you can see and click on the add component and again add the rigid body this one you can see the rigid body and the box collider again click on the add component and the box collider 
So you can see the box collider. Now we need to shatter this plate for by clicking mouse. We need to add a script into the plate. So just go back to the assets, go to the scene and right click, go to the create and click on the C sharp script and try the plate click enter open your C sharp script okay so here you can see now just select these and delete then we do not need the void update and the void start so just write here the public game object we need a game object here the destroy version because we need to destroy the our object or shatter the object so just write the destroy now we need here the void on mouse down just write here the destroy game object because we want to destroy our object when we click on the our object so there will be a different angle different rotation and different position where our object shattered and break into the surface so for this we need to add the instant yet right here the this one game object which you write here the destroy version copy that name and paste here and we need to add the transform dot position also the transform dot rotation of the R object press the control s for saving your script go back to the scene now just choose that plate this one not the broken this plate just drag and drop this script into the your plate here now you can see this plate break script added to your this plate a few times ago i told you for the just drag and drop into the, your asset and save it so this one you need to add this plate broke into the this plate the into the destroyer version so just drag and drop here in this you can see you add this plate broken now just press play now here you can see in the game view when i click on it our plate will be broken like this bowl here you can see our script is working correctly now when i click on this cube you can see that this will be break into the small fragments so how we can create fragments for this you need to go back now here just select a cube so for creating the this cube small fragment we need to add the 8 cube at this small size into the scene so just copy this cube just press the control T or just right click on the cube and just here the duplicate eight times so now create a empty game object and just rename it cube breaking now you need to add these eight cubes as a one big cube without intersecting each other take a look how i am doing you need to do the same choose the cube 1 here now you need to choose the cube 2 
and just drag and move forward side now again click on the cube 3 and just drag the backward side do the same for creating a big big cube okay so here in the scene you can see i added or adjust these eight cubes without intersecting as a one big cube okay so now you need to select all the eight cubes by press the control and drag these eight into this cube breaking now here you can see the breakable parts of cubes and just select the cubes again all these eights you need to now add the rigid body in the inspector by click the add component and you need to add the rigid body first and you need to add the mesh collider here just tick this box convex and change the mass the 22 drag this into the your asset and save it here and just now again untick this fragments of cube and again you need to add a fresh cube over here place this cube at the same place where your the cube breaking fragments placed increase this so first we need to add the rigid body into the cube so choose the cube and here add the rigid body and already in the cube we have the box collider so we do not need to add the box collider go back to the assets and add the this plate break script again into the and here in the none game object we need to add the this one cube breaking drag and drop destroy version and just save your scene by control s and just press play now when you click on this cube cube will not divide it into the small fragments just go to the cube breaking until this one cube and this cube breaking here just stick to again scene in the scene view and here you need to add the sphere at the middle of this eight cubes go to the hierarchy right click and choose a sphere and here we have the sphere eight cubes will be attached to this cube otherwise our cubes will be not fragmented these fragments will immediately collide with the sphere which will gonna help to destroy on the surface click at this sphere here and just drag into the cube breaking with these eight fragments again you need to drag and drop into the your assets again you have to drag and drop this cube breaking into the destroy version now this time on the scene here you can see our bowl, our plate, our cubes will be perfectly shattered and breaks into the small fragments. So this is it guys. I hope you will understand surely and you will like my video. So thank you for watching my video. See you in my next tutorial.